Let's learn how to work with URL query parameters in route handlers. In our data.ts file, we have an array of three comments. Now, imagine we want to filter these comments based on a search term. For instance, when you visit localhost 3000 slash comments, you will see all three comments. But what if you want to see only comments containing the word first by going to slash comments, question mark, query is equal to first. Let's jump into VS Code and see how to make this happen. In route.ts, present in the comments folder, we have defined our get handler function, which returns the array of three comments. This is the route handler we need to modify. First up, we need to work with the request parameter. While we've been using the standard request API until now, in the context of Next.js, the type we are actually dealing with is next request. Import it at the top from next slash server and specify the type in the get handler. This next request object provides convenient methods for managing query parameters with ease. Let's update our code. Within the function body, we grab all query parameters using request.nextURL.searchparams and store them in a constant called searchParams. Then we use the get method to fetch our specific query parameter. So const query is equal to searchParams.get query. If there is a query parameter, we filter the comments to only include those containing the search term. So const filtered comments is equal to query if it exists, comments.filter and filter comments such that they include the query parameter. If there is no query present, respond with the original comments array. Finally, send back the filtered comments as JSON. Let's test it out in the browser. Navigate to localhost 3000 slash comments and we continue to see the three comments. Now specify question mark query is equal to first and you will see just the first comment. Try changing the query parameter value to IR and you'll get both the first and third comments since both contain IR. In case you're wondering how to work with multiple query parameters, you can access them individually using searchparams.get passing in the parameter name. Very straightforward. But this is how you work with query parameters in route handlers. They're optional, but they're absolute gold for adding powerful features like search, sorting, and pagination to your applications. Supporting the channel is free. Please like and subscribe. It helps a lot.